last couple weeks I've been in a little bit of a rut, just kind of fishing the same spots over and over. Actually for the last several months I've been kind of fishing the same spots over and over. And they produce, but it gets a little boring. So today I found a new spot. I'm gonna fish it for the first time. Looks like it's a pretty small lake or a pond. I don't know when a lake becomes a pond or what the diff real difference is, but it's a pretty small body of water. But we're gonna try to get some uh, large mouths and peacocks. So I got my Nico Helgramite on a 1 8 ounce jig head, one of my go-tos. Gonna fish that on my medium fast, seven foot one inch St. Croix Victory Rod. So hopefully there's some fish in here. We're gonna explore it and hopefully get into some and have a good time. All right, so first impressions, I'm not really sure. It looks very fishy. We got some nice deep water here close to shore, but it also looks like it's very grassy and tons of lily pads around the perimeter, which could make fishing a little tough. But we got our little Nico Helgram on a 1 8 ounce jig head. Let me slide this down on the hook a little bit better here. We'll cast this out, try to work it back in slowly. And let's hope there are some fish. I don't think this lake is highly pressured or really pressured at all. It's basically on the back of this little industrial complex. So there should be some fish in here. Oh, first cast, there we go. Oh yeah, little largemouth. Good start. All right, so this certainly is not a big fish, but uh, first cast on a brand new body of water, I will take it. So let's get this guy back. And let's keep fishing. Hopefully that is a good sign of things to come and it's not the first cast curse. So like I was saying before, I was very pleasantly interrupted by that little guy. This is a very small body of water, but I, I don't think it's fished really at all. It's kind of on this back road behind, I don't know what these are, factories, offices, warehouses, something. So I don't think there's too many people hopping back here to fish. So less pressure, hopefully that means good fishing. Here we go, fish on. Let's work him on through here. Another largey. All right, fish number two, we're only about maybe 10 casts in. This guy hit kind of right on the edge of that grass line. Thankfully, got my rod is a little bit of a heavier power. It's medium power but it's got enough backbone to bring these guys in through these grasses. So good start so far. No size on these guys, but we got two fish on roughly 10 casts. Here we go, fish on. Oh, came off. Little guy, smallest of the day, that is for sure but we got a decent amount of action here. Yo, fish on. Oh, that was a tiny guy. Uh, so I lost two fish. However, they were both literally like five, six inches. They feel so much bigger. This victory rod, if you watch my review of it, the sensitivity on this thing is very, very good. I mean, those little five, six inch bass feel like they're so much bigger, but I doubt I can even hook up with those guys. All right, so action died down. All I've been doing is casting out and usually pretty far, I don't get too many hits. Usually once it gets closer to the edges of all these grasses here, I get a couple hits, so I hooked up with those two that I showed you. I had maybe another three or four hits. Just, I think, I think all these fish are pretty small. I also saw a couple bass kind of in between these grasses, and they were, again, seven, eight inches, so nothing too big so far. And I'm almost at the end of the pond, if you can believe that. So I might have to find a new body of water.
and there was another hit. <sighs> so I'm getting a lot of hits, just all, I think, too small for me to hook up with. But this looks like a really promising spot. We're at this little cove, deep water, lots of lily pads, lots of grasses. I had two hits here already on my last two casts. See if there's a bigger guy in there. Go. Got one. Took forever, but we pulled out our third bass today out of these lily pads. All right, so we've had an extremely promising start, those two fish early on. After that, I had maybe 10, 15, 20 hits. This is the first guy we were able to get on the bank. I lost two earlier, but I think a lot of them are just too small. I mean, this is almost a third, maybe even half of this guy's body length. So I think a lot of these fish are just a little bit too small, but we'll get this guy back. Hopefully we can pick up a couple more. All right, so I walked over on the other side trying to fish that side, but it's tough because the weeds come so much further out where you really can't, can't fish this effectively. So we're gonna walk kind of backwards to where we started and hope we can pick up a couple more of those fish that I missed on the way down here. little guy <laughs> come on up here another bass yeah so I think this is basically what this lake has I'm still getting a lot of hits they're just all very small that I'm having a hard time hooking up with them so just a bunch of little bass haven't even seen anything else in here so we'll keep fishing don't mind catching these little guys hope my hookup ratio improves though All right, so I broke off my second Helga mate today. That was the last one I brought with me. So I tied on this little neg rig, ne ned rig type little worm with a little curly tail type thing. <laughs> Don't know the actual name for it, but we'll fish that around. Just gonna try to fish this close to the grass, a little bit slower. We'll see if we can get anything on that. Fish. Oh man, I got a fish. Second cast with this thing. All right. Nice bass. So first cast on the Helgramite, we got a fish. And then second cast on this little Ned Ray type thing, we got a fish. Nice bass. Bigger than the most of the ones I've caught today, I think. So let's drop this guy back. And let's keep going. Another little guy. All right, second fish on that little Ned rig. So again, no size on him, but at least we're catching some. So that might be our last one though. All right, so that is going to do it. Uh, the action, if we're counting the number of hits I've had, that was phenomenal. In about two hours, I probably had about 25, 30 hits. However, uh, the sizes of them were really, really small. Really tough to hook up with them. Uh, the ones I did hook up with, they were all, all pretty small. Most of them, I don't know, 10, 12 inches or so. There might've been one that was like 13, 14. Uh, so not too, too much size on any of these fish today. And that's been kind of the thing that I've noticed with a lot of these smaller ponds that I fish. I don't go, them too, I don't go to them too often, just because I never had too much success on them. I like to stay with the ponds that I've produced in the past, but we tried a new pond out. Uh, the scenery here is beautiful. I love the way this pond looks. Unfortunately, the fish just weren't too big. So, hope you guys liked it, and I'll see you next time.